recording here. Here we go. Checklist today. Okay. So you have officially passed below A1 and A1. Okay. Now we're moving on into these skills today. Let's see how many we can do. All right. First one here is going to be can express basic intentions with simple time markers. Ergo, tomorrow. All right. This is in Pasantai. It's very simple, dude. Mm -hmm. It's very simple. It's tomorrow. I will go to the supermarket, All right? Simple. Ah. Tomorrow, I will take a shower and exercise. Next week, I will, ba 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 ba. That's it. Okay? And it's about the future here. So, can you give yeah. me three, th three things that you're going to do, right? Tomorrow, next week, next month? Uh, yes, tomorrow. I'm not sure, but I will go with my friend a little bit. Ding, but not like a party, just, just ding and talk. Perfect, right? Drink and talk. Uh, it's where maybe yeah. a, a pub somewhere, right? And then relaxing and yeah, yeah. life. Yeah, cool. Sounds good. All right. Uh, let me see. Next one, right? Next week or next month? Uh, next, uh, next week. Um, next week. Um, how is it? Next week, my friend, a lot of my friend in my school, debut or they would review. They will uh go back to uh their home. Oh, they will go. They will go back home. All right, good. That's two. Yeah. All right. Now maybe next year. Ah, uh, next year I will come back in Germany. Next year, you will come back to Germany. Perfect. Okay, boom, done. I think you can do this skill in English. What do you think? Yes, I think I can do that. Yeah. Pass. Okay, all right. Can initiate and respond to simple statements on very familiar topics. Okay? A familiar topic, bro, is just a topic that you know a lot about. Right? So, for example, it would be scooter. Right? Scootering. Or it would mm -hmm. be yeah. um, PUBG. Right? PUBG. You're, that's a familiar topic. Right? Uh, yeah. Germany. Germany is a familiar topic for you. Switzerland, uh, mm -hmm. working, all of these are yeah. familiar topics. Okay? All right, here we go. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, all right. Uh, why do you like, why do you like scootering? Because I like to jump with scooter and see down how, how high can I jump? Perfect. Good. Okay, I'll take it. Uh, next one here is going to be, can you tell me a little bit about exercising, right? Why is it, why is it good for us? Or why is it good because for Because I want exercising, like uh, fitness or? Yep, mm -hmm. exercising, every, all the exercise uh, we're doing. Yeah, yeah, muscle. Because I have, I, I want to have a, a nice body. Uh -huh. Okay, all right, good. I want to be strong, right? I want to have a nice body. Uh, yeah, yeah. I, let's yeah. throw it. Don't change. Don't use nice and say strong, right? Like usually for strong. women, yeah. Usually for women, we'll say nice body, right? But for men, we try. Ah, to use okay. Yeah, yeah. I mean, if you women can say a man has a nice body, but if a man says mm -hmm. I have a nice body, it's a little gay, all right? Just let it. <laughs> okay, just a little bit. Okay, all right. Yeah. Now the this was responding, right? So I ask and you respond, right? But initiate means that you have to start it, all right? So I want you to try to start a conversation with me on a topic that you know a lot about, all right? And those kinds of topics could be Thai. Uh, it could be uh, learning English. Uh, it could be having a girlfriend. Uh, it could be traveling, you know, things that are simple and you know about, and then you have to start a conversation with me. Right, that's what initiate means, right? To start a conversation. I mean, uh, start to talk, like. Yep, uh-huh, all right, like you, we're just meeting for, you know, a beer or something at a pub, right? Mm -hmm. And then you want to talk to me about something, how do you start? Um, the most that I ask someone who I see the first time, or I know, they already, um, I ask, uh, what is your family's hobbies? What is my favorite hobby? Okay, all right. Uh, well, yeah. I'd say my favorite hobby is um, drinking beer with Sam, right? Drinking beer with Sam is a good <laughs> hobby. Uh, I like relaxing. I like eating. Mm, mm -hmm. 
I, I wish I could snowboard, right? I wish I could snowboard. That would be really cool, mm -hmm. right? Like that kind yeah. of, okay. And then ask me a next question connected to that. Yeah. Uh -huh. Another question. Um, yeah. Why, why you want to become a teacher for English? Okay. Uh, let's see. In my life, I have had many different jobs and I was good at most of them. At the end of the day, I always felt like complaining, right? Complaining is like, mm -hmm. oh, this job is bad or this boss sucks or this. Uh, is yeah. enough, right. Um, and then when I started teaching, I never felt that way. Right. I never felt like I needed mm -hmm. to complain at the end of the day. I don't like bullshit. Right. I don't like bullshit and bullshit is when people are fake and you don't know what they want and you don't know what they're talking about sometimes. Right. Because they're fake. Right. You know, fake. Yes. Mm -hmm. Right. I find that in teaching people are very real. Right. People are mm -hmm. very real. And so that's the reason why I think I became a teacher. <laughs> that was a good question. All right. Pan. Pass. All right. Very nice. Good. Okay. Can talk about hotel accommodation using simple language. All right. Welcome to the Ritz Carlton ah. Hotel, sir. How can I help you? Ah, uh, yes, I want to how say this this for one room. A room. Okay, you'd like to reserve a room. Okay, all right. Welcome, welcome. Yeah. Well, let's for see. For one one week. For one week. Okay, so you'd like to rent it for mm -hmm. one week here. What type of room would you like, sir? What uh? What kind of room? Uh huh. What kind of room would you like? Ah, it's say for, like um for, can take my friend. Can take your friend. Okay. So how many mm. beds will you need? Uh, three. Three beds. Okay, three beds. So would you like a suite apartment or would or a suite or would you like two rooms? What is uh different? All right. Oh, good English now. Nah. <laughs> okay. All right. This is a suite, right? And suite mm. room, penthouse. It usually has a living room, right? It's usually a lot more expensive. Okay. So we say this same thing as like pasantai one, right? Suite, suite in English. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Right. But it's spelled S U I T E, like suit. Right? Uh, no. right? Now we have, you should know about different kinds of hotel rooms, right? A hotel room yeah. because you will need to book different hotel rooms. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. This is the standard, right? Standard for many hotels, right? Got single room, that's one bed, double room, yeah, one bed, two, two bed, bed, or one big bed, right? Twin mm -hmm. bedded room, that's two beds. Interconnected room, they're connected. Triple With room. Two room like. Yep, uh-huh. Triple room. Oh. Maybe you could do for your friends, right? Triple room. Quad is four rooms, right? Double, double room. That's going to be two rooms with two beds. <laughs> so confusing. Uh, and then suite. All right. How about today we learn about single and double? Yeah. Right. I want to triple room. Sweet, huh? I want a triple room. You want a triple room. Okay. You want a triple room yeah. at the Ritz Carlton Hotel. All right. Yeah. That will be 12,000. Can, um, per can we see, for, for us, can we see the, the sea? You want the sea view, the ocean view? Yeah. Oh, good. Okay. All right. Here we go. We got triple room, sea view, right? Or ocean view, like that. Okay. Ocean room. Mm -hmm. All right. Swear, triple room, sea view, see seven days, 12K THB per night. Okay, cool. Uh, I have, I have a, how to say, um, I have the card from, from this hotel because I have been this hotel before. Okay. And it's, I can, let's wait for, uh, 20% discount. Uh, you have a 20% yeah. discount. 
Or yeah. Ritz Carlton, Ritz Carlton from let's say from a membership membership package maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Fair yeah. enough. Okay. Cool. All right. Okay. So that will be let's see here. That will be nine thousand nine point six k per night now per night for that, mm -hmm. and that will be times seven nights. Okay. It will be about 70,000 baht, right? About 70,000. With the uh, breakfast and, and dinner? Breakfast and dinner. Breakfast in, is included, right? Breakfast is included, but dinner is not. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. All right. So going with the triple suite there. Okay, very nice. 70,000 baht, about 1,900 euro, right? 1,900 euro. Is that okay for you? It's a bit with a breakfast already. Breakfast included. Yeah, I think. Breakfast, uh, breakfast buffet included. But no dinner, right? Dinner is a la carte, a la carte. Okay, okay, oh, a la carte, yes. Oh, you know a la carte, okay, right, nice, perfect. Yeah, this for the uh, sushi. Huh? Uh, do you know omakase? Omakase, ah. Uh, no, I don't, what is that? It's like um, oh, I think I know. Go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like this style. Oh, okay. So you want to know about omakase? No, it's, uh, I mean, uh, I look uh, a lot of omakase video. Uh huh. And now I know a little bit from Alakot. Oh, okay. All right. You're interested mm -hmm. in sushi then. Okay. Nice. All right. Nice. Right on, dude. Okay. Cool. So may I have your passport, please, sir? Uh, yes, please. Okay, I'll take your passport here. Okay, so congratulations. I think you're able to uh, talk about hotel accommodation using simple language, mm -hmm. right? Now, the next thing is, is that next time when you have to go, I do recommend Googling different types of hotel rooms so that you remember the words, right? But just think about it this way, bro. It's going to be single, double, and then after that, you have the highest one, which is going to be quad. There's some more inside of there. Mm -hmm. We'll go from there. Okay. All right. Boom. Check, check. Done. Okay. Can make requests related to immediate needs using basic fixed expressions. All right. This is super easy. Here's in Thai. Okay. All right. You are in a set in central mall in Thailand, in Bangkok. You need to find the bathroom. I'm a security guard and you have to ask me a question. What do you say? Um, uh, excuse me. Can you tell me where it's toilet? Sure. Yeah. No problem. Go straight. Turn left, go straight, turn right again, and then you'll find the men's bathroom. Mm -hmm. Okay, next, yes. you and me, we are having a drink inside of a German pub, right? We're having a drink in a German pub, and then suddenly I have a heart attack. <gasps> and I'm like this on the ground. Uh, what do you say? Uh, uh, how say? Hello, someone can, can help me, please? My friend, uh, he have. How's it again? Heart attack. How's it? Right. Uh -huh. Can someone hear me, please? Uh -huh. No problem. I'll write it down for you, bro. So we have mm -hmm. heart and then attack. It means that uh, someone who ding a lot, right? Like? No, no, no. It, uh, that's not drug. That's not uh, mal. It's um, it's like this where your heart stops working. All right? Yeah, yes, but, but I know when someone who ding a lot. A lot. Yes, yeah. yes, definitely. <laughs> For sure. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. All right. Oh, I have a heart attack. I'm having a heart attack. Okay. And then what do you say? Yeah. Uh, can someone hear me, please? My friend, he's, he's, he don't he's need dying. to die. You're like, he's dying. He's dying. Help me. Where's the doctor? Right? Yeah. Okay. All right. <laughs> okay. Fun. Fast. Okay. Very nice. Good. Next, next. <laughs> okay. This one is super easy, dude. Okay. Short description of home, family, and job, and mm -hmm. I'm not going to help you, right? This one says I have to help you, but you can do this by yourself. All right, go. Oh, can I say like my home, my school? Yep, you just talk yeah, about okay. your home. Yep, talk, talk about your home. Mm -hmm. I want to talk. Uh, yes, I want to talk about my school. In my school, there are uh, a lot of people uh, who not from they are not from Germany. How say um they are from other countries, different country. 
Yeah. And um, in my school, they make a level. The the beginner is R one and R two. Uh, B one, B two, C one, and C two. I'm now same for as C one. Yeah, it's almost the same as English. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm now, and I'm now from C one for Germany. <clears throat> German. You're in my German classroom. Germany. Yeah. In my classroom, uh, uh, for now, uh, four people. And I hope the, I hope the next week. Um, uh, more people. Cool. Yeah. All right. That's a that's actually a medium description of your mm -hmm. school. Yeah. Right. This was this skill was like short description. So that's good, dude. Um, I you already talked to me about your family before, and you already talked to me about your job and searching. So for me, I feel like we can do this in English. Yes. Yeah. All right. Pass. Okay. All right. This one is very easy. When you don't understand me, what do you say? Right. Ah. Can you repeat again? Uh, good, easy. Nah. All right, easy, Mark. Okay, all right. Okay, can ask basic questions about color, size, price, etc. when shopping. Okay, so now uh, we are at Armani Exchange. Okay, Armani. Oh, money exchange. Yes. Okay. Uh, I wish I had a t shirt from this. Um, it's not my style to buy expensive clothes, right? But mm -hmm. my friend has an Armani Exchange t shirt. It was like, wow, it was like 10,000 baht, right? 10,000 baht, and it was really nice, right? Okay, so we're gonna shop for t-shirts now. Mm -hmm. Okay, all right. So you are now at a Armani Exchange t-shirt shop. Oh, one second. Okay. You are at an Armani Exchange t-shirt shop, and now I just want you to ask me some questions, right? So we're in a shop, right? You want to buy an Armani Exchange shirt. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, uh, yes. Um, for now. I want the t-shirt. Con logo? Con logo. Okay, this one right here. Yeah. No. All right, let's take a look here. Okay. Looks like it is a standard black t-shirt. Would you like any other different colors? No, no, um, I like the back color. Oh, you prefer black. I prefer black too, right? Yeah. Oh, I prefer black. Oh, nice. Okay, all right, good. Uh, let me see here. What size would you like, sir? Um, I want to M. M size, medium size. Okay, all right, medium size here. Size, color, shape. Uh, we also have a short, medium, and long style as well. Uh, I want, I think I want medium. Medium size, uh, medium size length as well, right? Okay, so it's not yeah. too long and not too short. It doesn't show your belly button, yeah. right? All right, this is your belly button, right? Okay, all right, nice. <laughs> okay, good, all right. I think you can do shopping in English, right? I think you can do shopping in English. Mm -hmm. Yes, okay, all right, good. All right, do you know the word borrow? Borrow, uh, it means uh Sam, can i, I borrow five up, euros uh -huh. yeah i give up to my friend yep 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 okay all right good uh so we are at we are at the shopping mall at the armand exchange store and you don't have enough money and you need to ask me to borrow mm -hmm. oh uh paul can you give me some five euro give you five euro or borrow five euro oh can you give me some five euro? I give you after. Okay, I'll have back. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Yeah. For this one, we gotta use the word borrow, right? Borrow. Yeah, borrow. Yeah. Versus lend. Okay, it's you better, know. Better like, Huh? It's better when I say borrow. Borrow is better because when you say give, uh, the person mm. will think that you will not pay him back. Will not. Ah, oh, okay. Understand it. Right. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So don't use give there, right? And that's gonna be able to. Yes, the person will think that you will not pay back the money. Mm -hmm. That kind of thing there. Uh, so let's see here. I would like to borrow and then and anything. Okay. Now, the lend here is the direction that's different. Lend is the person who 
lets someone borrow. All right. So here's an example. Let's say that Sam wants to buy a house someday. Buy a house. All right. Sam wants to buy a house someday. All right. He doesn't have enough money. Have enough money. So he needs to borrow money from the bank. From the bank. bank. Is the lender. The Teacher bank. bank. Yep. No, 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 no. Different bank. Right? <laughs> bank uh, right? Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> teacher bank. Oh, okay. Teacher bank. Uh, does teacher have bank have enough money to pay for your house? Maybe. Right? Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> right. A bank lends Sam, let's say, 1 million euros. Right? 1 million oh. euros for a house. Right? Uh, for a house. And that's that, dude. Right? You. Yeah. E. No. E. No. What's the sign for euro? Sign for euro. Euro. Uh, EU. EU. Yeah, this one, right? Oh, EU. Okay, all right. That's right. Okay, all right. Yes, that's how you know I am living in Thailand. Okay, all right. <laughs> okay. And so when you borrow, that means you take. And when you lend, it means you give. Yeah. All right. Okay, cool. Uh, let's see. Oh, that mean uh, I lend. That mean I keep money for my friend can borrow me. You got it, right? And so we have lend, mm -hmm. lent, that's past tense. We got borrow, mm -hmm. borrow like this. All right, so how much have you lent to your friends in Germany? <laughs> right, um, total. For me, if someone borrow me, uh -huh. I, I, for maximum, I give 10. Borrows from I lend 10. The maximum, maximum, maximum I lend is 10 euros. 10 euros. All right. Okay, good. Uh, okay, that's good. Um, I try not to let people borrow money. Yeah, I got to be honest, right? I try not to let people. Yeah, but I, I, I lend only people who I touch. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's just uh, that they're very close, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. So what's, yeah. what's the total all together that you think you let someone borrow in germany like 100 euros 200 euros like total like uh, entire what, if, 10 euro 10 euro 10 euro like that i borrow someone um only i think one or two euro one or two euros oh you borrowed one yeah. okay okay all right yeah okay so sam has borrowed one or two euros from friends in germany all right his friends have borrowed more from Sam because he's a nice guy. He's a nice guy and he trusts trusts only his friends. Clear. Okay, nice. Mm -hmm. That's good. Uh, okay. Do you know the phrase uh, no business with friends? Don't do business with friends you know this idea no. huh uh, yes I, I i know i do this uh every, everything every time yeah you know this already oh good yes. all right um i've done a few businesses with friends over my in my life and most of the time it's hard right most of the time it's hard Why? As, because the things that you expect from a staff member Right, let me give you this word expect. I think you know the word expect. Expectations, expectations from staff are different from friends. I think that's one of the biggest things that's different, right? And then if your friends fail, if your friends fail, you have to tell them. Hey. How they failed right when people work together right when people work they work together you got to work on it uh and help them help them be better right like you know when i first hired bank he he's definitely my friend right bank is definitely one of my friends for sure right um but i would say he's don't tell him this, okay? Right? But I would say that he's definitely more my staff and employee than my friend. Right? Mm -hmm. And it's a little bit sad when I say that. I got to be honest, right? And I think it's mm -hmm. because it's because he works for me, right? And yeah. he's a he's a partner with me in another company, 
right? And mm -hmm. it's okay and it's good. It's just, it's, it's not, I don't know. I don't know. It's complicated. Yeah. Sometimes it's good though, because you can trust them, but sometimes not. It depends. <laughs> it really does. Yeah. But the rule, the rule is like 90% of businesses, right? 90% of businesses with girlfriends, girlfriends, wives, and friends fail. Right. And that's something that, yeah, people studied this, right? Yeah, they studied it, you know, where like most businesses fail, right? That's the thing. So that's the thing you should know, right? Uh, some of them succeed, right? Some of them succeed, right? Okay. It's a, also an easy way to lose friends, right? Also an easy mm -hmm. way to lose friends. Okay, all right. Ken has to borrow things using basic fixed expressions, all right? Now, let's just double check real quick, okay? All right? So Sam borrowed one or two euro from friends in Germany. Who got money? My friend. In this sentence? Who, oh, in this sentence. Me, yeah. me. Okay, all right. And then in this sentence here, your friends got money, yes? Yeah. Clear. Okay. Oh, okay. All right. Can describe a person's hobbies and activities using simple language. All right. I'm pretty sure you can tell me about hobbies. Did you ask the Samoan guy about his hobbies? Um, yes, I think. Yeah. Okay. Tell me he, about the Samoan guy's hobbies. Yeah. He like, he like, um, he's, you know, Rolando so much. And I think he, he like to play football. Okay, he also, like, uh, soccer. Well, what was what was the first thing that you said? Cristiano Ronaldo. Oh, okay. Uh Cristiano. Okay, he likes football. His his hero. No, his hero is Cristiano Ronaldo. Ronaldo. Okay, all right, cool. All mm -hmm. right. Do you know anything about Cristiano Ronaldo's story? Uh, not too much. Um, I only know really one part, dude. It's that I think his mom was on drugs and his dad ran away and Cristiano Ronaldo was born as a poor kid with a mom on drugs. Yeah. And then he became the biggest, craziest football player in the world. And he has the most followers on Instagram. Um, in, yes, I know this. Yeah. Oh, you know that already. Okay. All right. Yeah. Which, yeah. Is, which is pretty crazy in this world. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. Boom. Done. Okay, how are we doing? Oh, I think we can finish A1 today. All right, I think we can finish yeah. it. Yeah, I think we can finish A2. Okay, all right, here we go, here we go. Okay. All right, this one here, can end a simple phone call to family or friends using basic fixed informal expressions. All right, basic informal fixed expressions. Okay, uh, I'm, I'm your mom. Okay, yeah. I'm your mom. Oh, oh, bye, bye, bye. Oh, sorry, oh, oh. Uh, kito, kito, kito. Okay, all right. And then she's speaking English now, right? And then yeah. you have to finish the phone call. How do you finish? Uh, yes. yes, mama. I have, I don't have enough time. I want, uh, I want, I need, uh, how to, I must go with my friend and we don't go party. We just talk and drink. <laughs> Okay, um, all right. What? No, yeah. okay. <laughs> all right, what? No, okay, okay. All right, all right, all right. okay. Uh, let's see. Um, I have two points for you, okay? All right, two points. This is not connected to English. Uh, with your mom, always tell her you love her, okay? All right, when you're ending the phone call, always tell, your, <laughs> tell her you love her, okay? Mm -hmm. all right. Number two, when you are talking about stuff like going out with your friends, right? Mm -hmm. Don't say, I'm not doing something bad. Okay. Don't say I'm not. I, uh -huh. I, I never say that. I you never said. Oh, you always say to me. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. <laughs> um, yes. <laughs> Don't say. Yeah. It's it's a uh, psychology, bro. Right. You know psychology. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Psychology here, bro, is that if you say something like, "I'm not bad. a no. bad guy," right? This is the wrong thing to say, right? You're supposed to say, "I'm a good guy," right? Lots of bad guys, right? They always say like, I'm not doing this, I'm not doing that, right? Like that kind of thing. Uh, there's this one guy, his name is Nixon. I'm not a crook. Okay, in America, this was this time here where this guy, he did something very bad and very corrupt, right? Very, very bad and very corrupt here, right? We have corrupt. 
corruption. Yep, corruption. Okay, good. You're done. All right, corruption there, right? You got that there. And so this is what he said. And I want to say this to the television audience. I made my mistakes, but in all of my years of public life, I have never profited, never. So he starts doing this already, right? And this is like lots of people analyze this and said, this is not what you do, okay? I have never profited, never profited from public service. Profit means make money from being a politician. No, from public service. I've earned every cent. And in all of my years of public life, I have never obstructed justice. Right, and so there, I have never obstructed justice means that I never broke the law, right? Or I never <laughs> went around the law. That I welcome this kind of examination because people have got to know whether or not their president's a crook. Well, I'm not a crook. All right, and then crook is a guy who steals things. Ah, okay. All right. And so this speech has been analyzed for many years, brother, right? And then that's where they say, oh, yeah, I'm not a crook, okay? And that's just a tip for you, okay? Just a tip for you. <laughs> okay, all right, good. Okay, pass. Next, can talk about furniture and rooms using simple language. I have a question. Did we talk about your furniture and your room at your house already? No. Yeah. Yep, okay, you can do it, okay. Can we talk about, did you, did we ever talk about what people are wearing? And wearing is just clothes. Mm, I don't think, yeah. Okay, all right, here we go. I'll give you a hard one, okay? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's really hard, I <laughs> think. Hard, Mark. Okay, here we go. Uh, okay, I'll give you the easy one first, okay? What is she wearing? Um, I'd say this. Starts with a D, the R. The, uh, the, the yeah. Right, dress, okay, you got a dress yeah. here. Okay, all right, dress here, okay, all right. Dun, 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 okay. Uh, what is this in English? Lock. Huh? Lock. Lock, is that pasa, is that, is that German? Uh, in English, we call it a skirt. I think it's German. I think it's German. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, we call that a skirt. Okay, all right. Oh, no, you got to learn clothes names. Oh, no, you got to learn how to uh, say clothes in English. Uh, okay, okay, all right. Because, like, you know, uh, it's important, man. Okay, it's important. <laughs> okay, uh, let's see here. Okay, so let's take a look at these beautiful girls here. All right. Uh, we have the lady who's tie, right? The lady who's tie. Lisa. Lisa, she is wearing, all right, for dumb cup, she is wearing a necklace, right? She's wearing a she's necklace. She's uh, wearing a necklace. All right. Uh, this here, you can call this a blouse, right? Blouse. 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 Right? That one is going to be the most basic one, right? Blouse here. Right? Blouse. Uh, okay, yeah. for a woman. Yep. Common uh, clothing in English. Oh, man. Looks like we got a test for this, bro. Okay, all right, uh, let's see here. Female clothes in English. You just need the basics, all right? Not like super, super intense. Okay, all right, here. Like, I like talking about hard, uh, interesting stuff with you, you know? But these are mm -hmm. things like, these are things that you definitely have to learn. Okay. Right. Yeah, someone someday I go shopping with my girlfriend. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Exactly, right? Shopping with girlfriends, yeah. you're gonna need to know the close names, right? Um, mm -hmm. If you're doing laundry, right? If you're doing laundry, sakpa, right? It's gonna be helpful. Uh, if you're living with a girl someday, right? You will have to know about these kinds of things. Uh, mm -hmm. Lots of other situations where you'll need to know close names. Okay. All right. These pictures. Mm -hmm. These pictures are not very high quality. Hold on. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. All right. This is a better picture. <laughs> okay. Hold on. Uh, I'm going to stick this right here. Okay. And then. Okay. That's okay. All right. Here we go. Okay. All right, so let's see. Okay, take a look at this one here. This is a necklace. Necklace, yeah. All right, necklace. 
All right. And then because you're a young man, okay, we got bra, panties, and thong. Mm -hmm. Okay, bra, panties, yep. and thong. Okay, going back to this here. Okay. Um, okay, do you think she's wearing a bra? Yes. Okay, do you think she's wearing a bra? Yes. Do you think Lisa is wearing a bra? Yes, but not, not, uh, but cannot be right. this. Uh, okay, all right, good. Yeah. Okay, and then, so we have skirt, right? Skirt, and then we have dress, right? Skirt and dress. Yeah. This is a dress too here, right? This is the dress. Yes. And then remember this one and this one is a blouse, right? This one right oh. here and a blouse here. This one here is like a suit. We call this a suit. It's the same thing for a man. Mm -hmm. for oh, a man. the same for men. Yeah, yeah, same for men. But uh, for a woman, I mean, we'll call it a, a woman's suit. A woman's suit, like, mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, all right, let's take a look here. Um, I think BTS is another Korean group, I guess. All right. Yes, yes, BTS. Yep, I'm just looking for male clothing, okay? All right. Yeah, my sister, she's crazy with this group. Oh my God, your sister is crazy about them. Holy moly, <laughs> right? Like she's like BTS <laughs> forever, you know? Like forever. Okay, all right. Uh, yes. What is, what is, what are these called? How about that? Let's we'll start easy. Uh, Jean? Jeans, correct. What about this thing right here? Necktie. Perfect. This, okay. This thing, necktie, yeah. You got it. What about this thing here? Suit. 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 Yes. This one, it's a little bit different than a suit, okay? For a suit, yeah. it should be similar color here and on the bottom, all right? But because this guy is wearing jeans and this here, we call this a jacket. Or blazer. Second, oh, okay. jacket is easy, right? Blazer yeah. is better, right? But yeah, it's kind of long, right? But jacket is easy. Ah, oh, it's for fashion. Yep, 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 yep. Mm -hmm. Okay, now what is this called in English? Easy one. Uh, not, not t-shirt. Um, shirt. Perfect. Yeah, shirt is easy, right? Shirt is easy. If you want to go next level with it, you can call it a button-up shirt. Right, button up shirt, right? But that's the, uh, yeah, like this with buttons, right? Button Another one. up shirt. Oh, yeah. with buttons. Like yeah, this. with buttons, yeah. Or you can do dress shirt. Dress shirt, yeah. Yeah, dress shirt. And so you think of this one here, right? Where it's very fancy, right? Very fancy, right? I saw a little bit. And then dress shirt is always going to be the one with buttons, right? Yeah. For someone who, like, um, minister. Yep, yep, yep. Um, you know, the people treat you so differently when you dr dress differently, right? Like, mm -hmm. I think when, if you learn how to, or no, you can dress how you want most of the time, right? But people always treat you differently by, by the way you dress, right? When mm -hmm. I saw, when I saw your profile picture on here, yes, right? I thought when I met, when I saw you, right, and then I compared to your picture, oh, wait, hold on. compared to your picture here, right? Number one is like, you're, you're like three, four years younger. You're such a little kid here. Yeah, yes. Right? You're yes. a little kid here, right? But you look good. No, um, I think this is uh, 14 years. 14 years. Wow, that's like five years ago, yeah? No, this is uh, uh, two years ago. Three years ago. Oh, you're only 17. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yes. Yeah. You look like a little kid here, right? And then now you look like a man, right? And so, but the thing is, dude, because I saw your picture like this for the first time, I thought already that you're a cool kid, right? And it would be different than if you were just wearing a t-shirt, right? Uh, hold on one second. All right, so let's see. Oh, you're checking your phone. Okay, cool. No problem. All good, all good. Okay, so when I was traveling in Australia, right, 
I was traveling for almost 60 days with my wife, right? 60 days traveling all through Australia and New Zealand. And I would sometimes look like this when I go to a hotel, right? Uh, yeah. I did a little test, right? I did a little test that I would go to the hotel like this, right? And I'd ask for a room and talk to them in English and rent something. And then I would wear a hat like this to the next hotel, right? Next wow. hotel like this. And when they talked to me, they changed the way that they acted to me, right? When I wore this hat, okay? When I wore this hat, I was just a kid to them, right? Mm -hmm. They were like, oh, we don't really have any rooms. Uh, it might be a little expensive for you. Um, you might want to try this place. For real, dude, mm -hmm. right? And it was just, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just a hat, right? It was just a hat, mm -hmm. right? Like it was so crazy to me because I would talk to my wife and I'll be like, okay, I'm going to test it, right? I'm going to do this right? and then see what happens. And then I'll just be all rip roy, you know? And like, it's mm -hmm. different, bro, right? It's different. The way mm -hmm. you dress is important, Cub, right? Okay. Yeah. All right, cool. All right. So, you know some of the basic clothes, right? You know some of the basic clothes here. Now, let's see if you know some of these other women, women's clothes here. Hat, yes? Yes. Ring? Yes. Earring? Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, tights? Uh, this is a new I'm one, right? Sure. Okay. Yeah. Tights here. Tights is the kind that all girls usually wear. Yoga? Yoga. Yep. Yoga pants sometimes, but this one usually they wear under a skirt right so, oh yeah so skirt here and they usually wear it under um nope no leggings here no tights here right yeah okay uh i'm trying to find they're wearing tights. i think this this one no these are boots right these are boots yeah it's boots. yeah um okay it looks like blackpink doesn't wear tights <laughs> right looks like blackpink doesn't wear tights i guess right uh wait here i think these oh wait hold on no is that a tight no i can't tell here no here uh wait 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 no those are not tights okay all right you know tights now a little bit all right mm -hmm. let me see when i go to sleep what do i wear or when a girl goes to sleep what does she wear pajama pajamas good okay all right what's this called uh handbag uh-huh does your girlfriend have a handbag no 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 handbag okay does she have a scarf mm. no no scarf uh what about bikini <laughs> yes yeah okay all right uh swimsuit do you know swimsuit and bikini how they're different yeah yes yeah. okay yeah because this swimsuit covers more right covers mm -hmm. more. and then you see this word blouse again mm. right Okay, those are the main ones, right? Slip, dressing gown, I don't think you need to know these. Okay, all right, cool. Boom, done here. All right, let's check out men's clothing real fast. All right, okay. Top row, I think you're clear. You know all of these words. Mm -hmm. All right, good, okay. Uh, did they say, did you huh? English say Hawaii shirt? Hawaii shirt, yes, yes, same, same. In German, same, same? I don't know um because uh, I don't sure if if I have this shirt uh -huh. like this. Uh, I don't know how to no, I can see it. I can see it. Let me uh, see. Like this. That mm, is not a Hawaiian shirt. That is not a Hawaiian mm -hmm. shirt. But it's similar, right? It's similar for yeah. sure. Yeah. Hawaiian shirts. Hawaiian shirts. They have to have this flower. Yeah, it's flower, yeah. Right, it's called uh, Plumeria. Plumeria, I think. We have it in Thailand, too. Right. Okay, cool. Business shoes, clear. Uh, singlet, clear. Tank top, we call this a tank top, right? Flip-flops, yeah. do you know flip-flops? Yeah. Okay, good. All right, sports shoes, jacket, cardigan. Let's skip that one. All right, you know this one for sure. You need to know this, All right? Yeah, I know you. Okay, cool. What about this one? You know this? Yes, yeah, I know you. Okay, jumper, no, polo shirt, you know, right? Long sleeve top, cargo pants. Do you know cargo pants? No. no. Cargo pants are the ones where they have pockets here, right? Pocket for you to put something in there. And then you see blazer again, right? Oh, uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, 
Uh, last question here is what kind of people wear trench coats? Um, Asian or... Oh, nice. Okay, Asian. Good, good, good. I like that. Uh, right. Grandpa. Asian or grandpa? <laughs> uh, my brother used to wear one of these, dude. My older brother. Oh, okay. Yeah, I would always make fun of him. I'd be like, dude, you look stupid uh it was fun. okay good all right okay let's try again now all right let's try again uh okay what is lisa wearing um i can't say the boss a jacket a jacket okay blazer all right jacket or blazer. blazer good what else i don't know this can can i say a t-shirt huh t-shirt T-shirt. Okay. Okay. All right. T-shirt. I will take T-shirt. Yes. She is wearing a T-shirt. Okay. Uh, and uh, necklace. 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 Yep. Necklace here. Necklace. Right. Yeah. This is a different style. Don't worry about that one. Yeah. What about this one? Yeah. Uh, or uh, earring. Yep. Got it. It's like this. Earrings are just this one. Right. This one. Link. Plus this. Link. Right. So you say ear ring. Ear ring. Yeah. All right, more good. Okay, all right, good. What's this? What are these? Uh, I'll say I get a cross hand cross. Oh, but it's gloves. Gloves. I don't okay. know. Gloves, 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 gloves. All right, gloves. But it's, okay. it's not for girl. Not really, so, so right? Cool. It's kind of like flat fashion gloves, right? Mm hmm Yep. Okay, and then what are these called in English? I don't know what this is. That oh. one is just same as what you wear when you go to sleep, right? Shorts, right? Shorts, oh. same thing, right? Shorts, and then skip this one. And then these ones are tights. Ah, we found some, right? She's wearing some tights. Uh, okay, all right, yeah. good. Uh, <laughs> it's so funny that I'm using the black pink picture. <laughs> okay, boom, done. Oh, okay, all right. Can ask somebody about their hobbies? What is this? Oh, this is two. Okay, I gotta delete this. One. Uh -huh. Okay, all right. Can I ask simple questions to find out about the subject. Oh man, I feel like we need to take a break on this stuff. I don't know. You want to keep on going? Uh, yes, I can keep on going. Okay. Oh, this is the guy that can run marathons. All right. Can I ask simple questions to find out about a subject here. Do you know what a subject means? Yeah. No, no. Subject is. Yeah. Kind of yes. Yes. Oh, okay. Know, yeah. Some subject is kind of like a topic. Okay. It's kind of mm -hmm. like a topic here. So let's see. Do you remember Benford's Law? Mm, I think yeah. maybe I didn't teach you. Yes, yes, yes. I know, yes. Okay. I, I taught you this. Okay. All right. Cool. So this is an example of a subject or a topic. Okay. All right. Yeah. So now, uh, you probably watched the news a little bit. Right, where this is all happening in America. Yeah. All right, so this is the topic. Okay, this is a topic, and this is where you can just ask me a few questions to get information about the topic. Cup. Uh, yes. What happened in this picture? Which one? Uh, all of this. Everything. Okay. All right. What happened in this picture? It's connected to this guy. Okay, and I'm not gonna give you. Oh, yes, I know. Yep. Uh, okay. All right. Uh huh. So you know, so you know how to ask questions. Then imagine, mm -hmm. imagine that you don't know, and you have to ask questions. Mm, I know this story. Um... All right, you know this story. All right, and so you have. Yeah. Imagine you don't know the story. Yeah. Right, and then we have ask me, ask me three uh, questions. I, I don't know what happened, but I, I don't know why the police take him like this. Got it. Okay, that's a good question. All right. Oh, actually, that's a sentence. Ask a question. Why did he do this? Why did he do this? Yeah. Yeah, one more time. Nice and clear. Why did he do this? Perfect. Okay. Um, uh, that's a good question, dude. Um, he, he says that he didn't know, 
right? He says that he didn't know. That's what this guy said, right? He said, I didn't know he couldn't breathe, right? I didn't know that it, it, it was broken, right? But other people say that he did it because he's racist. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's what is going around in the stories. I'm not sure exactly. I don't know inside this guy's brain. Okay, next question. Mm -hmm. Um... What's his name of the police? Oh, that's a good question too. Um, man who killed George Floyd, Derek Chauvin. Yeah, Derek Chauvin. And then it's crazy, dude. It says protests spread across the world, across the world, right? And then what does this mean? Protest. This. Uh, uh -huh, okay. And all of these are protests, right? This is a protest here. See? Right? Yeah. Protesting here. All of these people are protesting. And it's crazy uh, because this, it did happen all over the world, not just America, right? Yep. Okay. Yeah, in Switzerland too. Yep, 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 yep. Black, Black Lives Matter, right? Black Lives Matter. Boom. Okay. You can do this, right? Definitely can do this. Okay can make simple invitations using basic fixed expressions. All right, it is your girlfriend's birthday coming up, right? It's your girlfriend's birthday coming up and you have to invite me to her birthday party. Uh, yes, I can see that. Paul, hello, uh, did you have time uh, this uh, Wednesday? Because my girlfriend have a birthday on this day and I want to, uh, how do you want to ask you if that can you, if you can come. Or how Excellent. Do you, yes, that was good. Okay, good. Um, and then when you say I want to ask you, you can use the word invite, right? I want to invite yeah. you, right? Invite you is like this, right? Invite you is like this, right? Okay. Uh, good. What should I bring? Um, nothing. We have a lot. Of, we have all of this. Okay, good. Now it is your little sister's high school graduation. Okay, little sister's high school graduation. And you have to invite your family in English. My family? Yep, you have to invite your family to come to your sister. I mean, uh, my grandma, mm -hmm. my... Yep, yep. Imagine that they speak English and you have to invite them to... Oh, help. yes. Um, I think, uh, Oma, can I say Oma? Oma, Oma. It's it's mean uh, uh grandma. Oh, ah, uh, I think that's. I don't know what language is that. It's German. It's German. Oh, it's German. It's German. I know. I think you're gonna have to go with uh, go with grandma, right? Grandma. Okay, grandma. My uh, Suti, uh, she had the uh, congratulation from school. Graduation. On this, uh, yeah, on this Monday, uh, two, two o'clock, and she want to, she want that you come, and she want to see you uh, again. Okay. All right. Okay. And let me see. Two o'clock. You got the time. What's the date of the event? Monday. It's on Monday. Okay. And do I need to fly over there? Fly away. Uh, do I need to fly on a plane? Uh, yes. If you want, you can go with with boat. Oh, uh, go by boat. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna show this video to your grandma. No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Okay, pan pass. Okay, very nice. Okay, you can buy stuff in English. I think you can. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, I think. My friend from Zumba, I think he he really helped me too much to speak English. Why? Because uh, uh how say before I meet him, I don't speak uh, a lot of English. Yeah, 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 yeah. And now it's uh, a lot of people from USA. In the school. Yeah. Go. And they right. speak only English, you know, yeah, yeah, and sometimes yeah. German. Yeah, okay. See, that's the thing, Sam. You know, like I was telling you before where 
we have our English classes and it's really good when you're not using English at all, right? But then I told you before, if you really want to get better at it, you do have to start using it more, right? And then you said you started using it more and you can feel it already, right? It's really cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's good. Like I'm starting to use my normal speed when I'm talking to you now, right? And mm -hmm. I know it's fast still, but you are understanding more, which is good, right? Mm -hmm. right. Okay. All right, good. This one here is just asking for and providing things, right? Provide means to give. All right. Can you order order food in English? Yes. Absolutely. Did we do this in English already? Mm, we can try. I don't know if that we thought already. Okay. All right. Because I can tell you we did this one before, dude. Right? It's that talking about yeah. everyday things. That's like tamada things. Right? Simple mm -hmm. things, normal things, people, places, job, yeah. study, everything. Right? We did it already. Yeah. Right? We did it already. Yeah. Okay, all right. Uh, let's see here. Uh, okay, you. Ah, okay. Let's say okay. Let's say that we have a class, and then I can tell that you are drunk in the class. Okay, I can tell that you're drunk in the class. All right. And because then, I have been on the one time, right? I I don't know. <laughs> okay, I don't know, dude. All right. Um, I don't know what you're talking about. Okay, I don't know what you're talking about. Okay, uh, let's see here. So let's say after that, right? After that, uh, I get very angry and angry and I'm like, like this, you know, and I say, you have to say sorry to me. You have to apologize to me or else I will mm -hmm. tell your mom, right? Uh, and so what's a good way to say sorry for this, right? Oh, uh, yes. Um, I tell you, um, yes, um, I want to say some apologize about last week because um down a bit our hangover from from the last day <laughs> and uh, okay. i want to say i i, I detailed man I don't do this anymore <laughs> oh, detailed man sam too detailed too much detail no i'm just kidding okay all right <laughs> <It's>, <laughs> okay i have to teach you one thing though all right uh let's see <laughs> that's so funny okay all right we have here I apologize, right? And that's mm -hmm. going to be the verb, okay? And I have to make an apology for you. Apology to you. Oh, to you. Or I have to give you an apology. An apology. Mm -hmm. And then, so the apology is the noun, right? And so apologize is going to be the verb. Whenever you see something, yeah, verb. I, I Z E, right? That's going to be the verb, mm -hmm. right? And so I apologize. I realize, yes. Uh, and then we always this sentence structure is going to be I apologize for, bu, 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 bu. Um, and then that's usually the simple way, right? Uh, and then usually something connected to the future, right? Where you say like, oh, I will never do it again, you know, that kind of thing, right? Mm -hmm. But I think you know how to make an apology in English. Boom, done. Yeah. Okay, all right. Check, check. Can give simple classroom instructions, right? Can give simple classroom instructions, right? So this one here is, I want you to imagine that I'm a little kid in a temple school, right? Mm -hmm. And yeah. you have to teach me about clothes, okay? Oh. Okay, all right. Sadika uh, Kru Ajan, no, Ajan Pasanangrit, right? English teacher, okay? Yeah. All right, understood. Mm. Uh -huh. Should I say, uh, today I want to teach you about what we, what you, um, or what mm, people wear. Wear uh, every day or you. Okay, okay. Uh, ah, ooh, ah. What do you say? I, I'm a, um, okay. uh, uh, what happened? Did you happened? Have, don't want okay. to learn? Okay. Oh, uh, no, you just say, be quiet. <laughs> all right. Oh, quiet, please. All right. Quiet, please. All right. Quiet, please. Okay. All right. And then if I'm standing up, right? Standing up, what do you say? Uh, please sit down. Okay. 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 All right. All right. All right. Okay. Good. Uh, what do you want to teach me, teacher? I want to teach you our 
uh, what we wear in, in English. What do we wear in English? Okay, good. All right. Will you, are you going to show me a black pink picture and show me how to learn the clothes? No, no, this is not for kids. Uh, okay, all right. <laughs> I have this uh, uh, picture and you can see what you wear and you can show you how to. Oh, yes. Okay. And yes, and and this picture can you can say uh, what Doraemon and Dovita wear, or giant or are wearing. I don't know right? anyone. Are wearing. Okay, good. Okay, yeah. good. Uh, yes. Uh, Doraemon is wearing a hat and a jacket, and this what boy. Is... Uh, what color? Oh, what color? It is a yellow hat <coughs> and an orange jacket. Hmm. Very good. Very good. Thank you, teacher. Thank you, teacher. Uh, and uh, this guy is wearing a shirt and some kind of waistband and pants, right? Pants. Okay, pun. Pass. All right, good. Oh, good. All right, 32. Oh, my God. All right. Oh, oh. okay. All right, all right. Okay. Can make offers using basic fixed expressions. Okay, all right. Um, okay. You are the CEO of your company. Okay, you are the CEO mm -hmm. of your company, all right? Uh, you have lots of different employees and jobs and products, and you are interviewing me, okay? You interviewed me already, and you think that I'm a good person for your team, okay? Mm -hmm. You have to make me an offer, right? An offer to work in your company, all right? Make me an offer. To work in your oh. okay all right so okay. thank you for the interview uh mr buranyat mm -hmm. and should i say uh, i don't know uh, how about if you work for us okay because you well, have that's good yeah because you have a very really good skill and i i like your i idea and May I think I this idea can can help us in future. And then use like maybe help us in the future and grow, right? And grow. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, let me see. I have a question. Um, may I ask what is the salary? Yes. What's the salary, Kev? Sorry. Oh, uh, do you know salary? Salary. I mean, um, what I became if I do this. No, yeah. salary is money, right? Salary is money. money. Uh, salary, we usually talk about monthly or annual. Mm. Right? And then annual is for like the year, right? Mm. Yes, so what yeah, is we, salary in, in uh, Euro? Yeah, we are the big uh, company and we are the best company in the world. If you work with us, you become a lot of money. And if sometimes you are really bad or not come to work, your money will be Decreased. we don't pay for you oh we don't pay don't pay don't pay if you don't come to work okay that's fair yeah right? that's fair if i don't come to work you don't have to pay me yeah okay yeah. all right very nice and then i want to teach you one phrase real fast here uh, for this one for this offer right if you say how about this is a little casual bro right it's a little bit casual okay and do you know what casual means not sure. Okay, casual is opposite of formal, right? And formal is like, like this, you know, like very tight uh, suit or dress. Um, kabom, sorry, kab, kabom, chan, no, yeah, yeah. that kind of thing, right? That would be formal. And so, how about is a little casual, right? If you want to go formal with the job offer, it would be. To work, comfortable with us. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. And then if you do this same question with for us, it's actually different. Okay, so oh. this one here, would you like to come work with us? This is where I'm treating you like almost the same, dude, right? Almost the same. Not, no, no, puyai punoi. Okay, now this one here, would you like to come work for me? This one means that you think you're higher and the other person is lower, 
right? Mm -hmm. This one in English now, I would say never say, actually, never say. People don't yeah, like yeah, yeah. it. Yeah, people don't like it anymore, right? And so that's why this one is better. With us. Yeah, yeah with us. And then you already know, would you like to, right? Would you like to hear? How about is good for a casual suggestion? Right, so it's gonna be how about Chinese food tonight, right? Or how about Italian food tonight, right? And that's the way that you use it, okay? If you wanna go next level when you're talking to your friend or the person you like, right? It's gonna be, would you like to, da, 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 nice and soft, okay? All right, clear, all right, boom, done. Okay, dude, man, we did a lot today, holy moly. Okay, all right, we can do this. Okay, uh, let's do fast. Did you ask for directions in English? Mm -hmm. Right, where you say how to go to, but, 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 but right? Uh, yes. <clears throat> Hello, uh, I want to go uh, to Stan, Stan Station. Now I am in, in the bus station. Okay. Uh, the bus station. All right. And All I want right. to go uh, the R10 station. R10 station. All right. Well, you'll have to go straight and then ride for about six more, six more stops, then get off, mm -hmm. turn right, and then you can find it. Okay. All right. Pat, pass. Okay. All right. Can use brief everyday expressions to ask for and give personal details. All right. What do you think are personal details? Personal details. Where? Yeah. Oh. What you're wearing, right? What you're wearing, oh, you man, look like? woman, look like, age, right? Uh, country, yeah. language, yeah. hobbies, mm -hmm. married or single, right? That kind of thing, okay? All right, uh, let me see here. I think you did this already in English, too. And that I'm not sure. No? Okay, all right. Uh, okay. Let's see here. Okay, so you are living in Europe as an Asian person, okay? All right, and Farang people, they think Asian people all look the same, right? They think- And the Asia people think this too. The other way, right? Like all Farang people look the same, right? All foreigners look the same. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. And so this is a meme here, okay? I saw an Asian guy once. What did he look like? All right, and these two guys talking here. And he says, what did he look like? And then he's like, Milo, right? I don't know. Uh, you're laughing. Okay, you understand. Okay. <laughs> so, yeah. Okay, all right. So um, you are Leonardo DiCaprio, okay? All right, and I am mm -hmm. this guy, okay? And you and I yeah. were meeting for the first time and we have to share personal details, all right? Um, hello, my name is Paul. No, 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 uh, hello, my name is John, my name is John. And your name is Leo. Hello, my name is Leo. Okay, all right, nice to meet you. How old are you? I'm 20 years old, and you? I am 40 years old. Where are you from? Oh, I'm from Thailand. Are you married? And uh, No, no, no. I, I've, only, only kids. Oh, okay. Only You're kids. only a kid, 20 years old. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, okay. All right. Question? Uh, yes. And where you come from? I come from Germany. Right. I am. Oh, oh I, can, I can speak a little bit Germany. Oh, really? Oh, good to talk. Good to talk. Eins, weinsch. That's all I know. Okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. Good. Fun. Pass. Okay. Very nice. Good. Okay. Can compare quantities in a basic way. Okay, quantities, quantities, quantities. Uh oh, I got my son coming up here to say hello. Have you seen my son yet? Mm, no, no, but I see before, yeah. You saw some pictures? Okay, I'll show you my son real fast. Yeah. Come here, boy. Come here, boy. Come here, boy. Ah. Ah. Oh. Oh. Ah. Hello. Hey, cap gun. Daddy cap. Daddy cap. Daddy cap. Hey. Yeah. Say hello. 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 Man, look at this big belly, dude. Oh, oh good. <laughs> oh, you say what's up, huh? Saying what's up in Thai English? 
right. What do you think? Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Daddy, you gotta go back to work. All right. Here you go, buddy. Ah. Oh, you want to come back? Ah. Do, do you think he looks like me? Yes, I think you. Yeah. Do you he think he looks like you? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. And then this is my wife. Oh, wait. Uh, okay. All right. Okay. Bye bye. Let's gotta go to work, bro. All right. Ah. Okay. What? Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Okay. I think he has to stay. Right, I think he wants to stay. <laughs> oh man, okay. <laughs> uh, 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 uh. Okay, all right. <laughs> yep, he likes me a lot, dude. Okay, quantities, quantities. Almost done, almost done, almost done. All right, we will be done after we finish this, okay? All right, after we finish this list, we're almost done. Okay, quantity and quality, all right? Quantity versus quality here. All right, quantity versus quality. So quantity is how much and quality is how good. Oops. All right, so say with me. I'll say it three times. Quantity, quantity, quantity. Quantity. Perfect, okay. And then you know quality already, right? Yeah, quality, so, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, all right. So when we talked about quantities, dude, it's definitely every time we talked about money, right? Every time mm -hmm. we talked about money is about a quantity, right? 12,000 baht, 5,000 euros, okay? Okay, clear, boom, check, check, done. Okay, can start or end a, start a short conversation using basic fixed expressions? We did that one already before, okay? How to start and end a conversation. Okay, buying a ticket, I think we did that one already, yes? Yeah, yes, Excellent. like a hotel, right? Yep, exactly, um, you know, buying a hotel, take a hotel, or no, no, renting a hotel room, yep. That is yeah, harder yeah. than buying a ticket, right? Uh, okay. Buying a ticket is like airplane tickets, uh, bus ticket, train ticket, that kind of stuff. Yeah. Okay. All right. Simple distractions here. All right. Simple map. Oh, man, this kid. Okay. All right. All right, you can see this, yes? Uh, that's not a good picture. Okay, that's better. All right. Okay, Sam, we are at the cafe right now, and I want you to tell me... No, wait, this is not a good picture. My bad. I need something with street. No, I need something with street names. Okay, all right, that's better. Okay, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah street writer. Okay, I am over at Catherine's house, right? I'm at Catherine's house over here. All right, can you yeah. tell me how to go to the supermarket? Supermarket, um, Catherine house. Go on the light side and go this to the fish bed and after, oh, First, for the main street. Oh, main street, right? That one's main street. Main street. Okay, all right. So take a right, right? Take a right, go ahead to main street, and after, to left on the fifth street. Uh huh. And yes, just follow this street, and you can you can see the on the left side supermarket. Good. I was thinking that in my brain, right? You can see the supermarket on the left, right? That was good. Okay. All right. Very nice. Good. Okay. One more, dude. One more. Okay. Did you, all right, this is past tense question. Now I'm asking you, right? Did you give me a description of your school today? Yes. You did. Okay. Congratulations, dude. All right. Boom. That is, oh my God, dude. It is a hundred skills that we have done in your class. Right, a hundred oh. here. All right. Normally, it takes about three hundred hours to learn all of this stuff. Right? You learn some of it before, but the fact that you can do it is pretty good. I'm happy with it. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's give you. Okay. Let's follow up with some stuff here. What, the hell? what are you doing, buddy? Okay. Why are you such a dork? Okay. All right. Here. Okay. All right. Homework number one. Homework number one. Oh wait. Uh, did you make a video for me? I, I think I gave you a video. Oh. Okay. Oh, I, I just forgot this video. Okay. No problem. It's okay. All right. Homework number Today, one. Okay. Huh? You made the next time. It's okay. You can make a this video for me. Okay. All right. Homework number one. Uh, find a friend. Find a friend. 
I had a friend wearing some clothes. <laughs> okay, uh, some clothes. Uh, I right. think this is a bit. Uh -huh. I don't know. But oh, it's uh to uh, uh, they they just have to be wearing clothes. No, no, no. The, oh, did you mean? Try some clothes. It mean um. They have to have clothes, right? So that. Ah, okay, yeah, yeah. That, that would be easy. Okay, it's like it would be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't worry. I'm not doing the other way. Okay, that's weird. Black man. Okay. All right. Yes. Uh, I'm making a joke though, right? You have to find a friend yeah. wearing some clothes and then describe yeah. what they're wearing. Simple. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Homework number two. Homework number two here. And the following words. Following words. Uh, sick. We will cover them in the next class. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, brother. So I would like you to learn these words before the next class. Okay. It's going to be broken bones, backache, toothache, heartburn, 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 heartburn. What in the world? I got to get a big, better picture. Uh, okay. Love me, okay. Yeah, I guess this one's better. Okay. Yes. So please learn these words here on the right. All right. You know some of them already. We got asthma, backache, broken leg, cold, cough, or earache, fever, the flu, headache, heartburn, the measles, or rash, sore throat, stomach ache, sunburn, and toothache. Okay. All right. And then try to learn these words here before our next class. Okay, yep. Go with your video, and then we'll talk about it for our next class skill. But next class, we're not going to do GSE skills like this today, okay. right? I do this about once a month, right? Hardcore GSE, right? And about okay. once a month, I'll hit it, okay? But I think it's fun. I think it's good, dude, right? I think it's really yeah. good, right? For real, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, I like it because, man, you know, your motivation to learn is good, man. Your motivation is learn to learn is good. Your life is starting to grow and change, right? You're falling in love for one of the first times in your life, right? Um, and it's not my business, I know, and I'm sorry, I'll stop talking about it. Okay. <laughs> no, no, it's, right. it's okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's weird, I know, okay? I'll stop talking about it sometimes, don't worry, okay? All right, cool. Uh, <laughs> brother, I hope you have a good day at the gym and go handle your business, okay? All right, uh, yeah. you have two pieces of homework. It's where one video with clothes, very simple, right? And then number two is going to be being sick. All right? Okay, yeah. cool. Um, the thing with the clothes is I do want you to try to learn the cool clothes names, right? Try to know at least the names of cool clothes, right? Mm -hmm. So that's going to be like hoodie, suit, vest, sweater, dress shirt, dress shoes, those mm -hmm. kinds of words, yeah. right? Where you want to look at a guy that's a model and you can say what he's wearing at least, okay? Mm -hmm. All right, cool. Yeah. All right, have a wonderful evening, bro. I'll talk to you later now. Okay. All right. Okay. Have, bye -bye. Uh, have a night afternoon. What can I say for you? Uh, I would say peace out. Peace out is a good one. Peace out. Peace out. Right? Peace out. Very cool. All right, okay. peace out. Okay, have a good okay. one. All right, bye-bye.